Question 17. Tony and Gemma looked for snails, worms, slugs and beetles in their gardens. They each made a pie chart of what they found. So we've got Tony's pie chart on the left, Gemma's pie chart on the right. First part of the question says, estimate the number of worms that Tony found. Well, if you look at the worm section, you can see that this bit, what I'm drawing in now, is a quarter. If you put a right angle in there, that means it's a quarter. And Tony's pie chart contains 80 insects altogether. So if we work out a quarter of 80, half of 80 is 40, half it again to get a quarter would be 20. So one quarter would be 20, but you can see that there's a little extra bit on the end there. So it's got, it's got to be a little bit bigger than 20. It can't be 20 because it has to be a bit bigger. So the examiner will accept any, more, any number here from 21 to 23. So any of those, you can put in the answer for the number of worms that Tony found, 21 to 23. If we scroll down to look at the second part of the question, it says, who found more snails, circle Tony or Gemma? Well, Gemma, the snail section on Gemma's pie chart is a half, but her total is 36. So we need to work out a half of 36 for Gemma. So Gemma is a half of 36. Well, half of 30 is 15, half of 6 is 3. Put the two together, so 50 and 3 makes 18. So Gemma had 18 snails. Now we need to do a similar thing for Tony. Well, quick check of Tony's pie chart. Snails, there's a right angle. So snails is actually bang on a quarter of Tony's pie chart. And Tony's is 80. So we're looking for a quarter of 80. So one quarter of 80, half it and half again, we've already got that here, is 20. So Tony had 20 snails. So who found more snails? The answer is going to be Tony because he's got 20 and Gemma's only got 18. You've got to be very, very careful with this one because at first sight it looks like Gemma's got more. But remember, this is just a proportion of snails. She's, she's got half of her snails, but she's only got 36 insects altogether. Whereas Tony's got a quarter which looks smaller, but the but the reason is is that a quarter of eighty is twenty and that's still bigger than a half of thirty six which is eighteen. So just be careful and don't just immediately look at the size of the section on the pie chart. Make sure you take into account how many the pie chart is out of. So a quarter of eighty is twenty, half of thirty six is eighteen so Tony must have more snails.